We have to integrate uh, 2013 divided by 1 plus e to the negative x. Kind of a, a fun problem. So solution. So if you try to make a u substitution right at the beginning, you're kind of going to get stuck because you don't have an e to the x in the numerator. So you will get stuck. So it's important to rewrite this. There's a couple ways to do it. I think this is the fastest way. So let's rewrite it as 2013 over 1 plus e to the negative x. And what we'll do is we'll multiply by e to the x over e to the x. And when you do that, something amazing happens. Well, we have an e to the x in the numerator now, right? So uh, and let's clean it up and you'll see. So we get 2013 e to the x. In the denominator, we have e to the x times 1, so that's just e to the x. And then e to the x times e to the negative x is just 1, right? Now, if you're not convinced, just go to the side and check yourself. So e to the x times e to the negative x, that's e to the x plus negative x, which is e to the 0, which is equal to 1. So, yep, it sure enough checks. Now we're in a place to make a substitution, right? So we're going to set u equal to e to the x plus 1. So du is just e to the x dx. And now we're ready to go, right? We're ready to do this. So continuing, this is equal to the integral. Well, the 2013 is still there. We still have 2013. e to the x dx, well, that's just du, right? So here it is, e to the x dx. This is our du. So this is du all divided by, and e to the x plus 1, it's right here. e to the x plus 1, that's just u. So you get this. This integrates, the integral of du over u is the natural log of the absolute value of u. So we have 2013 natural log absolute value of u plus a constant. So this is equal to 2013 the natural log. What was u? Oh, it's over here. I'm really glad we write it down because I always tend to forget plus a constant. So that is the answer. Kind of a nice problem. You have to make a simplification first and or rewrite it first and then use u substitution.